So this is a system that was developed at DMG for posts and cores, the, the prefabricated glass reinforced composite posts with the appropriate um, uh, burr to create the space needed, the dual cure bonding system that is Luxabond, and it's going to be used with the Lux Core Z. And the reason we're going to use Lux Core Z is because the film thickness I addressed earlier at 20 microns basically classifies Lux Core Z as a cement. It's thin enough to be considered a cement. So we're going to use the Lux Core Z as a cement for the post we're going to put into place. And because it's dual cured and the bonding agent has dual cure abilities, we can use it in a cement in a dark space and not have to worry about getting a curing light all the way down to the bottom of a canal. And what we're going to try to do, there's been an idea that's been out for a number of years called creating a monoblock system. We're going to take the post, we're going to etch prime and bond the post space. And then we're going to take a post that's a glass reinforced fiber composite and cement it into place with a composite dual cure composite resin cement so that the dual cure composite resin cement will bond to the internal aspect of the canal it will bond to the glass reinforced fiber post I mentioned earlier and said I was going to talk about it now the flexural modulus of the Lux Core Z is very similar to Denton, so as this tooth flexes in function, the composite material flexes at a similar rate amount that the Denton will. So the seal will remain maintained. So the monoblock, next please. Yeah. So the monoblock is the post bonded to the cement, the cement bonded to the tooth, and all of this bonded to the Lux Core Z that's placed on top of the post, creating one integrated monoblock tooth slash restoration. 